Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Close Combat with me, Lord Cucumber. Okay, the battle, probably the final battle as I expect, looking at the date, date on the uh, left here, for Khan. Uh, Panzerleers up against the 50th British Infantry, and uh, they're well equipped, and Panzerleers also well equipped. Uh, they're pretty much equal in the stats department right now. Fatigue is slightly worse in my department, but that's okay. Because the Germans are attacking. Or, I think they are attacking. <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay, these guys only have 6-pounder guns. That is an issue. We are up against tanks as well, so we need to fix this or we will lose. Mm, we really need um, some form of tank support, but we don't have it. I do uh, believe I planned air support on this map and artillery support, so that might help. The Germans attack. There we go. So that's that's not bad. That's good. This is a good thing. Okay. All right. So th there's very few s points where they can spawn and survive this attack. Um. Considering all things considered, yeah, we we have a we have a pretty good s starting position. Let's see if we can get our six pounder guns into a position where we can actually strike at them. Mm, that's gonna be a tough one. Mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think he's gonna move with his tanks down the main street or at least across the main street. S it's a pretty safe bet that he will. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put one of these AT guns back here. And let's see, I can just shoot down the road. Yeah, that's perfect. Put them on the fence like this, so they can instantly attack whoever is coming down the road there. That's one. Second AT gun, that's a difficult one though. Where are we going to put you bro? I guess down here? Yeah, down here would be best I guess. It's probably the best idea in this situation. Oh, he actually has a line of sight there as well. Okay, that's cool. That's nice. I like that. Okay, so they're, they're protected by the buildings. Um, that's never bad. Alright, that means the Piat teams have become pretty important. They need to make sure that these Germans never leave the area. I'm going to put you guys up here on ambush. And also, just to be on the safe side, over here as well. Put you down here like this. Inside the building preferably. No, you're fine. You're okay. Alright, so doesn't matter if they come down this road or this road or whatever road. They're gonna get popped real quick. And that's what we want. Now to set up the rest of our infantry. Now last time I fought on this map, I recall at least, that the church area here was a a pretty darn difficult one to hold on to so that's gonna be a challenge we'll, we'll use whatever rifle groups we have left here on the in the bottom region <coughs> and I will move these troops somewhat into position here uh, yeah this is a pretty tough decision because we won't know exactly if we'll survive this run. Oh, okay. Can't move him there. Come on. Work with me here. <laughs> uh, so we need to stay in the back of the building just to make sure that we um, survive. We have a lot of mortar support. Okay, that's... Well, that's actually not a bad thing. This is their platoon headquarters. Okay, we need to. I guess we need to keep those in the back here. Move over here. You need to keep an eye on things. And then we have the uh, mortar teams. And I guess we'll put you guys in the rear here somewhat. Ambush for the time being. <coughs> Should anyone try to flank us there, we'll have at least somebody protecting that flank. We have a 3-inch mortar. Now that one is in 
pretty important. Um, we'll put you right behind this little house here on the fence as well. So that you can pop instant death onto the enemy. <laughs> Uh, and then we have the Vickers machine gun. Now that one, that one could be key to our defenses. Tempted to put him in the three-story building over here, but I don't know if they can see anything from there. We'll see. We'll we'll see. Where are they? Are they in the corner? They are. I need to do this. I guess no. What's the one? The one with the ah yes. Okay, so this is the Vickers machine gun. Uh, where should we put you, Vickers? I suppose we could put him over there, but I don't like that much. We're not going to let them carry it up all the way into the bell tower. That's just not smart. Defense like this. You can fire over the buildings and down the street. And that's it. So basically, these buildings over here are unprotected. That's not good. We need to fix that. But we'll, we will. Oh, 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 stop. Stop doing that. Okay. Alright, you guys. You're going in here. You'll be on ambush. Anyone coming close will get shot. Basically, you're a stopgap measure. And we have the officers. The officers will be... Well, we might as well put him in here. It's a bit far up, but uh, defending that re region is important. Let's see what kind of... Okay, they cannot actually communicate with their troops there, so we won't do that. So we'll simply go for this in that case. Alright, anyone coming down the alleyway will suffer for it. It's not a very good position, is no, it's not. It is not a very good position. We don't want to do that. I'll put him up here instead. Like so. Okay. There we go. So, that's good. Their officers are up there. And they'll be just dandy. They'll be fine. Um, okay. So that's the second group, and the third group will do the northern flank, basically. That's what we want to do. We want to make sure that all those troops are distributed somewhat equally over this area. Um, <coughs> let's see, we'll put you guys in here, I guess. Defending that area. And you will have... Oh, we didn't put the two-inch mortars in? Oops. Oopsie. That's actually a pretty important group. We want them to be near their bros, their buddies. And we'll put them in here just to on the fence and they'll start firing at whomever they can fire at, which is good. Probably not no one in initially, let's see. Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, if they move into these buildings, they'll get shot. Good. We have a brand group that we need to move up. And the brand group will be with our Commanders, I, I guess. Again, not an ideal position, but I don't intend to uh, do anything weird there. Okay, we apparently. Oh, I mixed them up. Well, that's fine. I don't know why I did that, but okay, I mixed up my defenders. That's fine. Let's begin. Already? Oh. Yeah, of course. Okay. Good. Incoming. 
Death from above, guys. Come on. Oh, we lost the gun. That's not good. Oh good, mortar barrage is available. I well, guess where we'll be dropping the mortars. Okay, he's moving in with that half track. Lol. <laughs> Alright, just lob one in. Go on. Come on! Use your damn shells! Okay. Didn't go as planned at all. A coward broken. No target. What do you mean, no target? You've got a target here that's. You have a perfect target here. Stop doing that. I'm gonna move fast into this building. Still have these guys. area has been secured, that's good. Move here. Okay, that team has been destroyed. Cannot fire at this thing properly. He's broken, he doesn't want to go anymore. That's fine. Okay, that tank is a problem. But maybe we can break it. Who knows? Try and recapture this area. We are losing a lot of men. I agree. One in there. Area secured. Take cover. Redeployed. Okay, that thing should be. Yes, beautiful. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, never mind, never mind. Go in here. Okay, well, so far, not so bad. Most of them are in here for some reason. Move fast to the other end of the building, go. Just leave it. Air support is available, that is good. Sneak up. I want to see where that tank went, if at all possible. Spot the tank, come on. Yes. Alright. Bye bye, tank. <laughs> Hopefully. A ceasefire. Hmm. Interesting suggestion. I don't think so. Oh, get in here. You, I mean, you may be broken, but I am not done yet. Okay, alright. Move fast. Go, gents, go. Piat troops right behind him. Okay, those guys are out of ammo. Go! Uh-oh. This could be my face. Lost and fatal mistake. Come on! Shoot this thing! Okay, well... We're still fighting. Holy crap. <laughs> Axis morale broke. But still, they captured areas uh, that were pretty crucial to their um, assault. So this might not end so well for us. Let's look at our soldiers here. Okay, so these officers really got the shit beat out of them. Uh, these guys were really brave. Apparently, I don't know what they did, but they did it. And then we did have these guys. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Wow, the Piat guys really did a number on these kind of enemies. That's good. Okay. The the machine gunners did really well. Fortunately, they also suffered some injuries and deaths. We did well with the uh, mortar team, and we got a tank with these guys. So okay. Let's view the opponent for a second. This guy, these guys were all wiped. These guys were pretty well <laughs> taken care of. They suffered at least 50% casualties, if not more. Probably more. Yep. Okay, these guys were <laughs> severely injured in the Panzer IV by the airstrike, eventually. Yeah, they have about 32% um, four strength left there so that's interesting all right so next time we'll be up against the second group of Panzerlehr which are these guys and uh, they're attacking uh, Bretville where the uh, Canadians are currently camping out and uh, yeah they'll be next time thank you all for joining me see you then